Number 15. What is the network output of a heat engine that follows path A, B, D, A in the figure above uh, with a straight line from B to D? All right. So basically, they want us to find uh, this particular uh, area. Now, what I did in problem number 14 is I found this area. Okay, I found this area. So just reference number 14 because I, I literally, I, I did all the same work, all right? And you'll see all the, the values there. It should be about 2,400, okay? Or 2.4, the answer, 2.4 times 10 to the third joules, okay? And then it says, uh, why is this work output less than that, uh, less than for path A, B, C, D, A? Well, because there's less area, all right? A, B, C, D, A, if we look at the picture here, A, A B, C, D, A, has a much larger area, twice the area that is, of A, B, uh, D, and that would be, I guess, why. I mean, we can get into different levels of why, right? But I'll spare you the philosophical discussion. Uh, so yeah, just check out number 15, did all the work there. The one I calculated in 15, though, was for A, B, C, D, A, and it would have just been half the value, okay? Uh, thanks, guys, for tuning in. Appreciate it very much. Please remember to subscribe. We'll see you next time. Take care.